A letter from the governor? It must be an invitation to a ball. What? Soldiers who can't even capture Zoro don't deserve to be in His Majesty's army. <laughs> oh. Hmm. Any one of them might be Zoro. Him. That's terrible. Him. Dude, anybody? That's why he probably wears that mask, Captain. Mm. So we can't recognize him. Quiet, mm. you idiot. He must no. have a distinguishing Believe feature, this Zoro. But what? One distinguishing feature of that Zoro is he's young. Mm. Gonzalez, mm? say that again. I I simply mm. noticed Zoro looks young. Exactly. Uh. He is young. Good work, huh? Corporal. You have just given me an ingenious idea. And that's cause for a oh. promotion. <laughs> Thank you, Captain. Uh. Hmm. It's just that there's lots of young men in California. How will we know which one's Zorro? Shut up, Garcia, and listen for once. We simply arrest them all, one by one. Every young man in the region until Zorro stops appearing. That way, I'll know I finally nabbed him. Oh! Uh, I'm oh. terribly sorry, sir. That was my fault. Throw him in jail, now! <laughs> arrest him! Halt! <laughs> Come now, Captain. Manuel accidentally bumped into you. <laughs> My dear De La Vega, Manuel is young enough to be Zorro. He'll be the first suspect on my list. Arrest him! No, please, I have a family. Oh. Oh. What is this rebellion? He's young too. Arrest him and toss him in prison. Bernardo can't be Zorro. He's deaf and mute. <laughs> that makes two. The list grows longer. And Diego is snug in his warm bed, sound asleep. I tried to wake him, but couldn't rouse him. <laughs> hmm? uh, I'm tired. <laughs> Alert! Zorro is here! Garcia, whatever you do, don't let him escape! Yes, Captain. Yes. Garcia, you dummy! Behind you! Zoro! Ah, excellent, Garcia! Keep on spinning like a top! You like this? Sergeant, I've never seen your secret pass. Perhaps we'll call it the Whirlwind of Los Angeles? Watch this! <laughs> Hurry, gotta take the down. We got him, we got Zorro! <laughs> this time, his goose is cooked! Uh. <laughs> oh! Sorry, Corporal. Lost my balance. Oh. Hmm. Well, my dear, you seem to be very concerned for that outlaw. Not at all. I I'm afraid that awful Zorro might escape from you once more. <laughs> Goodbye, senor. Zorro! 
Captain, we might as well release these two suspects since mm. neither one is, you know, Zorro. Oh no, we won't, Corporal. We'll keep them locked up. <laughs> they are part of my plan. Citizens of Los Angeles, all young men are suspected of being Zorro. Lancers, round them up. Yes, sir. Huh? Halt! Uh, uh, pardon me, Captain, but I'm guessing that'd be half the men of Los Angeles. That's a lot of men, for sure. <laughs> ah, I said arrest them. You too, my dear friend. <laughs> Let's be serious. I could never wriggle into Zorro's clothes, even with a girdle on. I am not Zorro. That's plain absurd. That may be, but he's in here among you. I can feel it. What? You mean I'm locked up with that terrible Zorro? That bandit? That outlaw? Let me out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, Gonzalez, you're just the man I need. You take oh. over for me. Wait, I just stuffed all the mattresses with new straw. Sorry, Corporal, but I am your sergeant. That was an order. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> all finished, Sergeant. Not a single tater left. Hmm, what? My, my. Then we absolutely have to hurry and take all the prisoners out to the fields and gather more potatoes. It's mainly because they're innocent. We must set them free. I need to find a way to get out of here. <laughs> I have a good idea. For two oh, days, nay, for two moons, no foods graced our forks or spoons. And this, upon the captain's orders, shall we never again leave these borders? Oh, no. ah, stop it. Hey. It's horrible. Every man must have food, hey. broiled, boiled, or stewed. Hey. I'm dreaming stop of him. beef soup and ah. cakes for my sweet, Friend, uh, no. Sweet tooth, no. please stop him. You have to help us. My friends, no need to applaud. That was my morning poem. Soon you'll hear the midday, the afternoon, and the evening poems. Whoa, Captain, sir, we've nothing left to eat. And Don Diego's poetry is keeping the soldiers from enjoying a siesta. Yeah, yeah, from doing chores. Sergeant, huh. only one thing interests huh? me. My plan's off to a good start because Zorro hasn't appeared once since we tossed all those suspects into prison, which is proof positive that that bandit is right here inside the garrison. You follow me, Sergeant? Mm-hmm. Captain, you're a genius. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look. Hmm. Uh, that one there. Huh? Huh. <laughs> if this keeps up, I'll lose a week's salary. You bumbling fools! Is this how you guard the prison? Hmm. If Zorro isn't here, he must be here. How simple. <laughs> With all his obsessing over Zorro, our dear captain's gone bonkers. You may be right, Sergeant. Hmm. <laughs> huh? Hands off, soldier. You'll get yours, and so will everyone else. <laughs> <laughs> you, you said everyone. Does that include us military men? Of course, Sergeant. <laughs> We've even brought a double serving, specially mm. for you. Oh, <clears throat> much obliged, ladies. <laughs> Ines, lovely to see you. As always, you look splendid, even behind bars. Hello, uh, Antonio. You seem to need a good bath. <laughs> Once the captain lets us out of this place, uh, I'll come visit you. You haven't forgotten, Antonio. I'm still quite upset. My goodness, Diego. They shouldn't make you sleep on the ground. Now don't worry. Zoro will come and fix all of this. Zoro? It's his fault that we're locked up here. <laughs> Zoro is courageous and he'll fight for justice. Forgive me for interrupting your endearing reunion. But Carmen Violonga... <gasps> You are under arrest. Oh. Carmen? There must be an error. 
I saw what she did the other evening. She helped Zoro get away. That's called treason. And arrest Ines de la Vega. She's obviously her accomplice. That's absurd. You might as well arrest my horse while you're at it. Right now. Hey, no. What? Out of my way. <sighs> I've now assembled all the bait we need to attract mm. Zoro. I don't get any of this. Isn't Zoro already locked up mm. in the garrison? Do you want me to repeat that for you again? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. I will now release, one by one, our prisoners. If one of them is Zoro, uh -huh. he will rush back to save Ines de la Vega and Carmen Villalonga. You see what I mean? Hmm. How will we know which one is Zoro? It's very simple. See, Corporal Gonzalez here gave me the idea with his Shuffle the Pebble game. Ooh. <coughs> Uh, Captain, could we perhaps release Don Diego before anyone else? We're mm. fed up with his poetry. De La Vega? Not a chance in Hades, he's Zorro. Empty bellies oh. growl in the prison huh? cells of Los Angeles, California, who, besides <laughs> me, is craving pumpkin spice. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, right. That does it! We will set him free first. Phew. Oh. Thank you, Captain. Don Pedro. You were cleared in the investigation. You can go home now. Not like Carmen Villalonga or Ines de la Vega. Those traitors. They are riding, as I speak, on their way to Monterey, taking the Camino Real. They will certainly get banished by the governor. Go now, you're free. <laughs> there you go. If Zorro shows up on the Camino Real, then the real Zorro can be none other than Don Pedro. <laughs> ah, my dear De La Vega, our investigation has cleared you, and you're free to go home to... My sister Ines and Carmen? Alas, I cannot do anything for them. They're on their way now to Monterey via the beach road. The governor will certainly banish them. This error is tragic. I shall protest vehemently to the governor. Sergeant, will you accompany Don Diego home, please? By force, if need be. Sir, yes, sir! Don Diego, I'm very sorry for Carmen and your sister Ines. You know who's to blame, Gonzalez. Really, Sergeant? Worst thing is, you get a fat promotion. Oh, no. I swear, it was him. And it was that bootlicker who gave the captain the idea to set you free so he could see if you're Zorro. Hmm, interesting. The captain told you the lovely senoritas and took the beach road. That way, if you're Zorro, you'd rescue them, and the captain would have proof that Zorro is you. Mm-hmm. The captain did the same thing with Don Pedro, but told him that they took the Camino Real. My gracious, don't you worry, though, Don Diego. We all know you're not Zorro. <laughs> Sergeant, I can't possibly prevent Gonzalez from cozying up to the captain, but I can offer you a hearty meal back at the Hacienda. Yeah! Yeah! Woo -hoo! Mm. yeah. Stay 
hidden men. If that devilish Zorro comes, or rather, Don Pedro, we'll flail his hide. What are you doing? You waiting for someone? Yep, waiting for Zorro. We're gonna trick him into... Huh? <laughs> Alert! Zorro! What? what? Zorro! Look out! Zorro! <laughs> <laughs> Surround him! Halt! This time he won't get away. Don Pedro, we yes! got you! Catch him! <laughs> Missed! Huh. And watch this! <laughs> Beautiful day for a stroll, gentlemen. Los Angeles is just a two-hour walk. <laughs> huh. I see. You've arrested us, and it's all just one big trap for Zorro. You ought to thank me. I'm willing to overlook your suspicious behavior. Once that outlaw has been identified, you will be allowed to return home. Ugh. Calm down, you two. It's highly unlikely Zorro will show his face here. We set a trap for Don Diego, and as everyone knows, he'd be one puny Avenger. But I preferred to enjoy the company of you lovely senoritas. I couldn't leave you all alone on this beach in the dark of the night. You <laughs> Zorro! My apologies, Captain. I'm a tad late. It can't be him. Troops! Go get him! <laughs> <laughs> Quite a catch we have here. No small fry. <laughs> On guard! You can take off the mask. I know who you are, Zorro. You're Don Diego de la Vega. Don Diego? Are you very sure? <laughs> That's for having arrested these two senoritas. Both charming and both innocent. Ah, I got seed! <laughs> Captain Monasterio promised to let us go, Senor Zorro. Please don't get in worse trouble by hurting him. <laughs> it was a pleasure to rescue you, ladies. Adios! <laughs> what a show-off that Zorro is. You can run away, Zorro, but I've unmasked you. I have won! <laughs> Let's go, Tornado. Don Diego, are you up? You ready to join me downstairs for breakfast? Buen <laughs> uh, dia, Sergeant. I slept like a baby. Hmm. Go on down to the kitchen. I'll join you there. <laughs> Phew. Hmm? Doña Maria, your raisin bread... Oh, please. Uh, huh? Captain Monasterio! Ines, Carmen, you're both free! How wonderful! Don Diego, last night you were on the beach, and you were the only one who knew we would be there. That means that Zorro is you, pathetic little outlaw! Huh? I was where? Arrest him. No! Wait, hold, hold on. Hey. Stop this, Captain. Diego! Citizens of Los Angeles, you can now sleep easy. That dastardly Zorro won't cause any more trouble. Here he is. Huh? Diego? Hmm. Uh, Captain, I'm pleased to say your plan worked. Zorro galloped out onto the Camino Real. Zorro stands before you, Don Pedro. It's not me. I'm innocent. Wait, how could that... Oh. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Zorro has to be one of these two individuals I released. He's either Don Pedro or Don Diego. Oh. Huh? 
Where are the prisoners? Well, see, they all took off pretty early last night. But if all our suspects went free last night, that means that any one of them could be Zoro. No! No big deal, Captain. We can simply arrest them all again. Gonzalez, this whole idea was yours, you fool. Prepare to scrape horseshoes for the next month. Get out of my sight. <laughs> Hmm. Uh, Captain, I've thought matters over and have reached a decision. This can't go on. Arrest me! Huh? Huh? <sighs> I can't bear this. Throw me oh. in prison. You will then see I'm truly innocent when the real Zoro shows up. Bring me my poetry books. <laughs> Get out! This garrison is not a hotel! Oh. Gentlemen, let me back in! Please! <laughs> <laughs> before we got back to California. <laughs> so you were in Mexico City? Did you see the palace of the Viceroy? I did. Wait, you're here alone? Where's Diego? Hasn't he come back from Spain yet? Diego hasn't gotten up yet. You know him, a sleepy head since he was born. I remember the day he made this Chumash bracelet for me. Yes, I remember that day well, too. You fell off your horse because of one of his totally ridiculous bets. <sighs> my father nearly chopped my brother to pieces. <laughs> oh, Diego. He was feisty and afraid of nothing. He hated being locked up indoors, reading books. He was so very handsome. <sighs> you know, Diego has changed a bit. Hush, not one word now. I like surprises. <laughs> Father! Diego, great news, my boy. I just saw Don Luis. His daughter Carmen is back. Carmen? How is she? You can ask her yourself. You and I will go pay them a visit. How about having your wedding after the harvest? Yes, you'll see. This one will unite our two families and be a historical moment for California. Hmm. Uh, wait. Uh, I just barely got back from Spain. Isn't it a little early to talk about marriage? You don't want to get married? Fine, then. We'll start with an engagement party. <sighs> Sergeant, the special of the day. Swordfish? You hear that, Gonzalez? Carlos has swordfish on the menu. Uh, hmm. Well, soldier, you go inspect the stables while I, uh, while I go inspect the swordfish. Uh, <laughs> but, Sergeant... Don't sergeant me! Those stables had better be perfectly clean. Hmm. Oh. Oh. Garcia? No. Oh. Good sir! Yes, Captain. Still interrogating the locals? Have you found anyone who knows where Zorro is? Uh, still haven't found anyone who knows, Captain. Well, ask everybody. Surely you'll find somebody who knows something. Oh, I know. I'll go ask all the employees and the guests at the inn. <laughs> Garcia! Garcia! <laughs> <laughs> Brush hard, Sarge. These stables must be perfectly clean. <laughs> that man, take him in for questioning. I'll interrogate him. Yes, sir. What? Where are we going? The army has fallen into disgrace since I left. Uh, will Monasterio ever stop harassing the people in this land? Oh, how I detest that man! Hmm. 
Ooh, have you heard about that Zorro? <laughs> More than heard. I actually saw him the first time he showed up in public. Lucky you. Don Luis, I wasn't aware that your daughter was back among us. Senorita, you are a sight for sore eyes. <gasps> Los Angeles is most fortunate to have the two loveliest roses in all California. Uh, Captain, you're exaggerating. Not me. Not by one single syllable, my lovelies. Mm. Uh, Captain, my daughter and I must return to our hacienda. Hmm. Oh. oh. <laughs> Hmm. Violonga won't act so cocky after I've had my say. Neither will the girl. you. Uh, what? Uh, Are you saying I used to be ugly? No, you've never been ugly. You've always been, uh, you always, I, I mean, uh, pretty. Pretty? And here I thought you'd have learned fancier words at college. I shall have to lend you a few books. <laughs> Hello, Don Luis. Hello, my friend. Aren't they sweet together? Let's leave them alone and go make wedding plans. <laughs> I'll have to add a few rooms to the hacienda for our future grandchildren. Uh, going overboard, aren't they? Right. Wonder what put that idea in their heads. How could you... You and me? What an odd idea, right? <laughs> We're two good friends. We've known each other for so long. For too long, perhaps. California has changed since we were children. Monasterio has made life more difficult for everybody. What are you planning to do to defend us? Huh? Nothing. What? Diego de la Vega, shame on you. It's a good thing we have Zorro. Uh, oh no, please. Don't tell me you're one of his admirers too. At least he's a man with courage and spunk. You still act like a little boy. That's awful. What is it? It's ugly, threadbare, worn out. Worse, it clashes with your dress. You should get a new one. Mm. Uh, I don't want a new one. I, oh, you are such a bother. Just go home. <sighs> <laughs> huh? Carmen Diego. <laughs> Captain, what good wind brings you to see Don Luis? Military business, Don Diego. Really, Diego? What came over you? Don Luis is my best friend. <sighs> I'm really sorry, Father, but I was bored to tears back there. I can't wait to be in the Hacienda to read my favorite poems. <laughs> you are absolutely right. I guess I did go overboard. Oh, I guess I'm not used to staying up without a square meal. What is this important matter you wish to discuss, Captain? Don Luis, there's talk in Los Angeles that you openly criticize me. Hmm. Says who? Those poor innocent people you randomly arrest for questioning? Surely you know that for insolence like that, I can have you arrested on the spot? However, I'm here to make a proposal. I want to marry your daughter. <gasps> Carmen? Absolutely. It would prove to everyone that you're loyal. <laughs> hmm. And would make you a rich <sighs> landowner one day. I'm warning you, oh? Violonga. If Carmen doesn't become mine, I'll ruin you. Hmm. Hmm. I'll be back to woo the little darling. Get out, Captain. I suggest you receive me with all the honors due to a man of my rank. Father, I heard you both. What will become of us? Don't worry, darling. I would never betroth my daughter to a bandit. Uniform or no uniform.
Nico, have you been out in the sun too long? Why did you say such silly things to Carmen? Because Zoro can't ever get married. Look, Carmen is marvelous. I would have loved to spend all day with her today. But if I marry her, she'll find out who Zoro is. And then she'd be in danger. Ah. <sighs> it's better to keep her away from me, for her safety. Huh? <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Diego de la Vega. <gasps> Good morning, Father. Sleep well? Good morning, Ines. If you do not go back immediately and talk to your fiancé and apologize on bended knee, I shall kick you out of the house without your poetry books. Mm. <laughs> hmm. <sighs> yes, Father, I promise. Today, Carmen will hear my guitar and my song, begging her forgiveness. Oh. Hmm. Huh? Hmm. Uh. If Ines hadn't told me you were deaf, I'd give you all kinds of messages to tell Diego. What a cad. Sending you instead of coming himself? Oh, I'd like to sink my nails into him. Thanks, Bernardo. Carmen's quite pleased. She <gasps> very much enjoyed the music. Oh. Huh? Oh. Hmm. Whoa. Oh. 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 No eating the flowers, naughty horse. Oh. <laughs> Hello, Bernardo. Hey, these flowers aren't for you. They're for Senorita Carmen. Hands off, or my captain will flay us both alive! I'm sorry, Captain, hmm. but I get the feeling Senorita Carmen may not like cut flowers. Hmm. Flowers! I can't stand flowers! Achoo! Oh, how pretty! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'll pay for this! Garcia! Yes, sir! Yes, Captain! Gather all the men. We'll go visit Villalonga. I'm going to bring that arrogant family to heal. Huh? <sighs> Hello, Doña Ines. We work, 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 night and day, just like slaves. Oh, why do we have to arrest everyone at Villalonga's? <gasps>
dilly-dally. Oh, no. Quit lollygagging. Oh, no. oh, move it! Move it! You can't do this. Oh. Captain's orders. We're taking everybody in. We'll be interrogating them about Zorro. And we'll take as long as we need to through harvest oh. time, if need be. Our crops would be lost. You want to ruin me? <laughs> oh. Don Luis, help us! Get out of the way. You can't do this. I'm with you. Don't worry, men. I'll get you out of this. <laughs> halt! Hands up! <laughs> Hurry! <laughs> <laughs> Senorita. <gasps> Captain, what are you doing here? I've come to pay homage to the future Senora Monasterio. Oh? Where might she be? Do we have another guest in the house? You are just like your father. You people think you can get away with anything because you're high-born rancheros. But I'll put you in your rightful place. Zorro! Captain? Oh! Senorita, forgive me for coming into your home without having been invited. But I do believe my friend the captain needs some advice and gallantry. Oh, phone guard! <laughs> the key to unlocking a lady's heart is patience. <laughs> <laughs> Women like poets. Did you know that, Captain? Maybe you should try telling her about the beauty of the stars. <sighs> Maybe you should just <laughs> shut up. <gasps> Zorro! <sighs> Got you, Zorro. <laughs> 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 Must be a sword fight in there. Zoro! Oh. Uh. Oh. Fire! What are you waiting for? Huh? Shoot that out! Hey! Uh, not in the house. We might damage something. Oh, oh I'm so sorry. Uh. Captain! Uh. I'm coming! Hey! Me first! <laughs> Lancers, block all exits. Yes, sir. On guard. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Catch him! <laughs> we got him, we got him! And watch this! <laughs> Catch him! <laughs> got it! Thank you, Sergeant! <laughs> You're welcome. Oh. Give up, scallywag! Grab that man! You're done, Soro! Oh. 
Captain, I suppose it's time to bid you adios, but I'll always be available should you need another lesson in gallantry. Hmm. Adios! Where did he go? Go find him! Yes, yes sir! sir. No sign of Zoro, Captain. He's mm. vanished, and the Peonis have vanished too. Your friend saved your skin this time, Don Luis. Maybe he won't be there the next time. Hmm. <laughs> Back to the garrison. Move out. Sir. Yes, sir. Sir. Senorita. Hmm. Before leaving, I wanted to be sure you're all right. Uh, I do want to thank you for your help, Senor Zoro. <laughs> oh! I shouldn't accept this, but you have risked your life for us. Please be more careful, sir. <sighs> <laughs> I won't let anyone catch me. I can promise you that. <laughs> Hurry, Tornado! Fight the wind! Ha 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 ha!